I just want to tell you a little easy way of washing your windows and the reason we're arriving at this right now. I, I just got out of the shower here a little while ago. Uh, as usual, I got the cart in front of the horse. Uh, I have had so many spider webs around this house. We've had a lot of rain lately. The weather's been kind of mild. Everything's growing like crazy. Uh, but I've been plagued with uh, spiders and spider webs all over the house and all the little bugs getting caught in it. I'm sure you have too. I mixed up a batch of this uh, secret uh, bug killer and I decided after taking a broom and brooming off all the cobwebs and things on the house uh, to spray the whole thing down with a regular uh, garden sprayer. And it's got an adjustable head so I put it on high and I sprayed that bug killer all over the house, uh, all over the trees and shrubs, everywhere I could think of. and. Uh, it left this milky residue on my windows because it oversprayed all over the windows. I was particularly getting up around the eaves and stuff underneath close to the house there. So uh, I want to show you a quick and easy way of washing your windows. Uh, nothing will make the life happier than looking out nice clean windows. And uh, I don't mind it myself. What I usually do is just uh, the sun has been warming up the water in the garden hose. I got one of these uh, California, what is it, a California water blade uh, silicone. I'm using automotive soap, just a little bit in the bucket, just like if I was going to be washing my car. And I've got my soap mitt, or uh, cheap skin type mitt that uh, I use to wash my car. Same thing. And uh, I used to do I used to do this the hard way. You know, I used to get Windex and crumpled up newspaper, and I used to uh, wash the wash the windows and you know soap them up, rinse them off. They'd be streaked, this, that, and the other thing. But this is a real <coughs> quick way, and I thought I'd demonstrate how easy it is. I kind of got the cart in front of the horse. I already uh, already did this earlier today. I did the whole house in probably 20 minutes just this way that I'm showing you right here. I have sprayed the house down with some uh, insect and bug control and uh, it uh, got all this milky residue all over my windows. So when I was looking out, it's like, oh man, <laughs> they needed to be washed anyhow, but I just uh, use the car wash mitt. You know, you get bugs and you get spider poop and all this stuff. And uh, just uh, wash it off. Throw the mitt over there. And I watched, used to watch the, the uh, window washers downtown when I worked in a big high rise building. And they'd go up there and work on this 52 story building all day long and they had these squeegees and they would do all these fancy moves so that they didn't get streaks you just take your hand and there you go if you see some streaks or a spot that you miss you want to overlap about a third of the squeegee just soap up the whole window and start over you see if, if you go and try to touch up and hit these little spots, you're going to leave streaks. You do like I showed you. You start at the top, you overlap like a third, just one pass over to the side, and you're done. Uh, you can mess around with the screens and all that sort of stuff, but I wanted to give you the general drift to the main thing. You go around your house and do the, uh, the windows that don't have the screens on it, and your wife will thank you. And uh, you'll enjoy looking outside at the summer a lot better too. So there you go. That's the window that we just did. You don't see any streaks or uh, bug poop on them now. It uh, cleaner than a whistle. So I don't know. It uh, was one of those things long overdue. And one thing led to another. And I got her done. So anyhow, make your wife happy. Spend 20 minutes. Do a quick window job on your house. Thanks for watching.
Thanks for subbing. Easy, jeezy, out.